Hello everybody, it's Random Terry here again, and I'm bringing you a little bit of a how-to video. I am making a 21st birthday liquor bouquet. Note my little bottles. Um, uh, I found a pack of uh, 15 of these little twisted shots of assorted flavors, and then I bought a bunch of little bottles to go with it and I actually am keeping some of these myself. She's not getting all 15 of these. So um, I start by gluing, hot gluing some of these little critters on my bottles with some dowels. And I believe I have these 12 inch, I believe 12 inch dowels from the Dollar Tree that I just glue on. I make sure that the face of my bottles are down, and this is the exact back of it. And just hot glue these little puppies on there. And it doesn't really take too long for them to adhere. Because you're using hot glue, and hot glue likes to stick. Just don't put your finger on it. Um, I do use this little critter from Dollar Tree also. Sometimes it's like a silicone spatula, a little mini spatula, but sometimes if I don't want to get my fingers too close to it, I push things down on it. Especially if you're um, gluing things that are kind of see-through and you're liable to get it on your fingers. So this, not so bad because there's no hot glue on the back of this. So I'll just put that back. So I will do that and set those aside. I have the rest of them done already. Um, and I printed off this little thing on cardstock. It says, yay, you can finally use your own ID. Happy 21st. I thought that was kind of uh, cute and kind of fitting. And I tied some curling ribbon around one of the dowels and make sure I have the right side. And just kind of put a little bit of hot glue on that. And glue that puppy on there. Yes, I know it's not a real puppy, but you do that, and then you can go along with either a knife or um edge of scissors and you can curl your ends of this a little bit more to make them more festive and give it a little little party to the bouquet and you do want to do one at a time because if you get more than two it doesn't curl as nicely And my knife is not a real sharp knife. So that just adds a little bit of hoo-ha. There we go. A little bit of hoo-ha, a little bit of festivity and to that stick. Woohoo! Okay. So I got an ice bucket, which seemed appropriate since it's liquor. And this is from Dollar Tree, and it is indeed called Ice Bucket. And what I'm going to do first is cut down some of these corners, just on the bottom. And I just cut right through this plastic stuff because you're not going to see it. Get rid of that. And then it will fit, and it can probably be pushed down in there a little bit and it kind of gets wedged in there now sometimes you can glue things and then this I will glue on top of it and as before 
I just hot glue right on the plastic because it will kill that plastic. Oop, and my hot glue gun's gone. But I think that's it. Using my hot glue, finishing my hot glue. And that will sit in there nicely. And you can just make sure that's down in there more. Whoop. No, I did not crack it. All right, so that's in there. It's not going anywhere. And you could squeeze a little bit of hot glue down in there if you wanted to make sure that stays in there. But um, that's it. I got these two foam pieces from the Dollar Tree as well. So what I'm going to do here now is pick a fancy um, shreds to stuff in here to cover up that. And you can kind of stuff it down in there too. And I might not need the whole bag because it might not all fit in there. But you get the idea. And with that, you start putting in your hot glued, that should be good enough, I believe, your hot glued things and start arranging. And I will see you after I do that. I'll be right back. Hi, just a little note that um, I ran into <coughs> trouble trying to put the things in the styrofoam. So I ran my dowels through the pencil sharpener to give them a little bit of a point. So they would go in there. You can see it a little bit better. So that's where I am and this is where we are so far. And we'll be back. So everybody, I have it completed. Um, there it is. And I did put some of the rest of the, um, the shreds in there to kind of hide the sticks. If you wanted to, you could paint the sticks if you wanted to put them colorful. But um, you can also get some of the shrink wrap or the basket bag from Dollar Tree and wrap this up. And it would make a lovely little 21st birthday bouquet. Let's move this up a little bit and I can move this back a little bit and maybe you can see the whole thing. All right, so that gives you the idea. It is a little bit top heavy. Um, one could probably even put, well, look at that. One of my things fell off. I might have to secure him with tape. Um, where did he fall off of? Oh, I see the stick. Okay, um, it won't be that noticeable, but this makes it festive for somebody's birthday and um with that i'll say goodbye terry over and out if you like what i put on youtube subscribe like share share me it'll help me out a lot thank you so much for watching bye